You're probably aware of the, the, the legal case that's taking place in America between the PGA and Live Golf um, uh, and the involvement of uh, the uh, Saudi Public Investment Fund. Um, you've been given assurances that uh, the, the Saudi government doesn't have any direct control over uh, uh, Newcastle United Football Club by um, Amanda Staveley. But in a statement that, in an interview that I saw on, on Twitter, she says that that, that uh, PIF is an autonomous, commercially driven investment fund. But in the uh, uh, submissions in the court case, that the public investment fund is claiming it is a government body um, uh, and therefore has sovereign uh, uh, immunity in, in, and cannot be called to give evidence or submit evidence in the, uh, in, in the litigation. Does, is that going to prompt you to uh, uh, revisit the Newcastle United Football Club arrangements? Um, I'm afraid I'm going to frustrate you, Clive, because I can't really comment on it. I mean, even to, even to the point of saying, is the Premier League investigating it? We can't, we can't really comment on it. Obviously, we are completely aware, um, and you're correct about the, the general nature of the undertakings that we received at the point of takeover. But I can't really, I can't really go into it at all. The only time when the Premier League comments, comments publicly on, our, on, on regulatory issues is when <coughs> it's charged, uh, and at the end of, that, end of the process when... Uh, an independent panel has decided whether any rule breaches have actually taken place. And the investigatory process, we don't talk about at all.